This is my Mark II tracking solar accumulator project and this is as far as I've got for the moment. So it's almost like uh, the frame is almost like a trailer and uh, it could be mounted on the ground on this side, this side and this. So it could have a three point uh, mounting on the ground. Uh, that's the main frame. This is the um, what am I going to call this? This is the outer rotating frame and it's got a rim of a wheel here and it rotates fairly easily and uh, that's for daily tracking of the sun. Seasonal tracking of the sun is going to be done on an inner frame which is going to be mounted on an axis uh, which goes through the focal point. So it's going to go from here to over there and the focal point is going to be in the middle of the wheel about this much back so about eight inches about uh, 20 centimeters back from the middle of the wheel uh, these are just stays to keep everything pretty steady so the user if they're doing solar cooking and to get around here I have no space for this the user would be here and uh, they'd have to reach this far in to attend their um, cooking pot. So it's uh, this is at my latitude. Like if if you're closer to the tropics, uh, this isn't pointed so much up at an angle. It's more level, and um, uh, this is uh, the high po uh, end of it is facing north. Anyway, there's the uh, bottom frame. Um, so the next stage is to put in a reflector which will be basically roughly a half parabolic dish and uh, um, tracking can be done. You just attach something to the wheel uh, through a hole here and at the far side just uh, some sort of string. And tracking can be done just hourly slowly turning it like this so very slow because equatorial mount your tracking is um, 15 degrees per hour so very slowly so it's probably easier than I thought I was dreading doing this I thought someone else would do it anyway there it is so far <laughs>